Hello friends. Welcome to this video of the number system. Today we'll solve some questions related to laws of exponents for real numbers. Let's start with our first question. Find the value of the following. Friends, the first option 1.96 has 1 by 2 in its power. That is, we have to find the square root of 1.96. In the previous class, we have learned to find the square root of decimal numbers. We will solve it this way. Its square root is 1.4. In the second question, we have to find the cube root. It can be written in the cube root like this. And on solving further, we'll get the value as three. Here, the power of 25 is 3 by 2. We'll write it in brackets as 25 to the power 1 by 2, and then whole to the power 3 in this way. The power of 25 is 1 by 2. That is the square root of 25. Now we have got 5 power 3 that is cube of 5 which will be 125 friends you can also solve it by writing it like this first by finding the cube and then the square root so far the numbers were positive numbers but here the exponent of 81 is minus 1 by 4 we can write it like this 81 raised to the power 1 by 4 that is the fourth root of 81 and now we get 3 to the power of minus 1 we can also write it this way friends we can also simplify it using the exponent rule we'll get the same answer in both the places that is 1 by 3 so in the second question let's simplify some questions using the exponent rules check this out in this the bases are the same and the exponents are different here we will use this exponential rule here a equals to 1.6 p equals to 5 by 2 and q equals to 3 by 2 now it will be written as 1.6 raised to the power of 5 by 2 plus 3 by 2 we got 1.6 raised to the power 8 by 2 we can also write it as 1.6 raised to the power 4 friends the second number is quite easy to simplify here we'll use this exponential rule a equals to 9 p equals to 1 by 3 and q equals to 5 now this will be something like 9 raised to the power of 5 by 3 let's see this one here too the bases are the same and the exponents are different so we will simplify it using this rule of exponents so now we can write 5 raised to the power 1 by 2 minus 3 by 5 subtracting 3 by 5 out of 1 by 2 we get minus 1 by 10 5 raised to the power 1 by 2 upon 5 raised to the power 3 by 5 can also be written as 5 raised to the power minus 1 by 10 now look at the last number here the base is different and the exponents are the same here we will use the rule of exponents Here a equals to 3, b equals to 5, and p is equal to 11 by 3. We get 3 multiplied by 5 raised to the power 11 by 3. We can also write it as 15 raised to the power 11 by 3 like this. Friends, that's all in this session. Today we have solved some questions on the laws of exponents for real numbers. 